Alright guys, uh, right now we're in a VW and we're going to show you some live data uh, and how to read live data from your, uh, your VW. Um, we're using the launch VIII which is shown in the link before uh, below this video and it's also known as the CRP129 but uh, we're using the VIII. Uh, it's exactly the same to be honest with you. Um, we're going to click into the, the engine needs to be running and we're going to click into the data stream option. What we could do is view all items. It's now gathering a list of information um, to basically show us. Now it's showing us uh, information here in the uh, the actual values, so as percentages, degrees, um, RPM values, things like that. And we'll scroll down the list. What I'll do is, in fact, I'll go back up at the top, and I'll just put my foot on the throttle here, just so you've got a good idea and you can actually see the values moving. So if you look at the RPM there, it's going right up as I'm putting my foot on the throttle there. And then, so you go through the other pages. And then what you can do is you can view this information on a graph as well. So if you wanted to say, for example, look at the engine coolant temperature, on the same graph as the RPM and the intake air temperature. Select those three and we'll just click escape to confirm. So we've got the ECT in red, which is the engine coolant temperature, the RPM in black and the intake air temperature in blue. Now we're just at idle at the moment as you can see the uh, the typical values are coming through so I'll put my foot on the throttle there and as you can see it gives you a better idea of what's happening with each system say for example when the uh, the RPM is uh, is fluctuating so the engine coolant temperature is 34 we've not started the vehicle uh, long so it's quite low at the moment RPM max is 270, 2070 and the air intake temperature is 10 degrees uh, well that's the max it's been as well so as you can see the uh, engine coolant temperature is gradually going up bit by bit we'll just put a few more revs in and then obviously those, those were just three of the items you can look at other items as well um, airflow rate from mass airflow sensor, absolute throttle position sensor, things like that. So there are quite a few. Um, but if you are interested in this uh, VIII kit, just click the link directly below this video. Um, it will read uh, fault codes and clear fault codes on the main systems as well uh, for engine, ABS, airbags, and transmission as well. Uh, so if you are interested, as I say, just click the link directly below this video. Thanks for watching.